Hi, I'm Beth Eggers with Y Mountain Flowers and Berries. I want to tell you a little bit about our farm and some of the challenges that we, we face normally and a little bit of what we're doing to try to prepare and keep our customers safe during the light of this pandemic. We are planning to open around Memorial Day and until a week ago, we well, in fact, we might be a week early this year because the berries, as you can see, they're just fully loaded with green berries right now. But in four or five weeks, there will be lots of blueberries out here. One of our normal challenges happened last night. Every year seems like we have a, a frost or a freeze uh, scare that we wonder whether it's going to damage our berries or not. And last night we did drop down to below freezing for over two hours. So hopefully we didn't lose any berries. They look like they only had just a little bit of frost damage. You can see the redness on the leaves, but the berries themselves, I hope were not damaged at all. Trying to protect them last night, we got up at four o'clock in the morning and burnt four huge brush piles, trying to get a layer of smoke over the field, which would normally raise the temperature some. We'll tell in a few weeks whether we were successful or not. What we're doing this year to prepare for people to come out and pick berries with us. We've been picking since 2011 and as people come out for the mornings, we open at seven in the morning and we start placing them on different rows throughout the berry field at the very best picking spots for the day. We'll still be doing that this year, but we'll be really intentionally giving them certain sections of the field to pick so that you know that you'll only be picking where no one else has picked that day and still be able to get lots of wonderful blueberries and shortly some blackberries too. Uh, as far as how we'll handle the payment system, we're going to do some reservation times online and you'll also be able to pay for your blueberries and or your flowers online this year. And uh, if you do need to pay here at the farm, we'll try to have a touchless system set up too. We'll have hand washing stations. If we're still in a, a real scary time, we'll be asking people to wear their face mask out here and we will have our face mask on too. We don't know what four weeks is going to bring, so we'll just be ready to change as, as we're recommended to do by the officials who are on top of all of this. We hope that we'll have a wonderful berry season and we're looking forward to the flowers too. We have lots of flowers planted for the farmers markets and as of right now we've been told that we will have to have pre-orders for the farmers markets and they'll only be delivered there, that there won't be any direct sales at the markets. Thanks very much for your time. Hope you have a blessed day.